Okay, welcome to Seniors Living in Paradise, man. Oh I wonder gosh. what you're gonna do this month here. Yes, we're getting you know, more exciting. I yeah. know, and then you know it's September, and September is Labor Day. Yeah, and salute all our guys, the hardworking men and women mean? out there. All we do, it's also harvest time. Oh! So today, oh. we are doing Wine 101. Hey, and you also get Wife Appreciation Day in September. It is? Yeah. Uh, it's on, I think, on, I think September 20 or something, okay. but I think September 20, eight days later, I get National Beer Day. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I can yeah. see why. I know yes. a lot of seniors, they drink wine. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you drink wine. But so. it's good for you, your blood pressure. Yes, yeah. red wine. Yeah. Yeah. All wine is good, yeah. but red wine especially, yeah. right? Yeah. So, what goes with good red wine, or what goes good with wine, yeah. period, this is called bruschetta. Okay? Oh. Oh. So, no, and you know, I don't like vegetables, yeah. but I made this one time. I go, oh my gosh, it's so, 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 so good. So wait, this is really simple. So if, if you're at home and then all of a sudden you get guests come over and you're entertaining, this uh -huh. is real easy to do. Bruschetta. So, yes, this is fresh tomatoes, okay. right? Yeah, fresh tomatoes. Fresh okay. tomatoes. You and, it. Yeah, and I season it now, so in that okay. way you know, right? Okay. So this is salt. Okay. We put pepper, okay. right? And I'll put the rest later, but just at least you know how much to put in. Okay. Right? Wait. I'm gonna okay. put a little bit more salt. Cause how you know you need a little bit more? Because I went like this, I pinched it, it was too small. You know oh, what I'm saying? Man, yeah. ah, but can I you forget. imagine you pinch my cheek? You're the too big. That's right. That's right. <laughs> okay, okay. You didn't okay. leave a bruise. Okay, you didn't okay, leave a bruise. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, so okay, I'm gonna put all of this. This is red onion. Yeah, yeah. Yes? Yeah. And then this is the white onion. Okay. It's a sweet onion. How can you put red and white? Pretty, that's why. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, okay, pretty, okay, pretty. Okay, okay. okay, so I'm gonna do that. Here, I'll give you this. You mix okay. that. Okay. Now, this is the big controversy. A lot of people, they don't like cilantro. So I you... love cilantro. Yeah, no, and especially, you know, in this, mm. oh my gosh, you gotta. You just gotta. Mm. I love cilantro. Okay, because this is what sets it apart from our, and plus to the color. Mm. So, we're gonna put some of this, right? Oh, Let man. Me see. Okay, oh. you see how nice it looks? Yeah. Now, that's with the cilantro. We're going to put a little, um, this is garlic. Okay? Uh-huh. Yeah. Wow. Oh, wait, a little what, bit more. What, what do you call this again? It's, nice. it's bruschetta. <laughs> bruschetta. Bruschetta. Yeah. Bruschetta. Oh, man. Okay, now the... the Sounds the, expensive, really. Yes, but you're gonna love it. Wait, cha, wait, cha. <laughs> okay, so this is, it's just like a relish. It's a, mm. it's a, you can even eat it as a salad. Yeah, it looks like lomi <laughs> No! Okay, okay. You better not tell Sorry. me, uh, Sorry. you better not it's tell me Italian that. Bruschetta, bruschetta. Bruschetta, okay. okay. This is extra virgin wow. olive oil. I'm wow. gonna put a little of that. Wow. Okay, and this is uh, balsamic vinegar. Wow, you okay. like your balsamic vinegar. I do. No, no, just because we just did it in the two shows. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. this is this is special though. I like balsamic yeah. vinegar. Yeah, vinegar is good for the body. So, this, and then wait, we got special. Just for you, you know what this is? What? I'll let you try one. This is Parmesan chips. No. Yes, so it looks like this. Okay, we put it in the oven and you bake it. Oh. And it comes out like this. It's a little oh. crispy, so. I'm gonna show you, but mm. we're gonna put it. I'm gonna show you. Thank you. Mm. I'm gonna mm. put it right there. Okay. Mm. Parmesan chips. Yes, gotta be Parmesan though. And I got the Parmesan from. Hey, thank you. Your workers going home. Thank yeah. you, thank you. <laughs> yeah. Okay, awesome workers you got. Yes, I do. Mm. Okay, the Parmesan, all mm. you have to do is grate it mm. and you put it on a, um, on a silipat mm. or you can put it on parchment paper, okay? Mm. And then also, this is the toast. I didn't want to make toast, mm. so it's this is just as good. Mm. And I really like this one. You guys yeah. came up with the panzanella. Like I like that one better. It's just like soda cracker. Yeah, yeah. So there's it, no salt on it. It's so like it's a little pilot you. Yeah. 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 I like that. Mm. This one is good if you're gonna have it kept out. Mm. You know? So we're gonna do this. I'm gonna show you. I have to show you a bunch of stuff that we're putting it together. So this is just something you can do at home and you don't have to worry about cooking. And this is prosciutto. Oh, I love prosciutto. That's one of my favorites. Yes. And this yeah. goes very good with wine. Mm. Okay, so now, wait, you have to try one of this. Here, take a small. a prosciutto. Yeah, take mm. a prosciutto, okay? And then, you, this is Kenzo wine. I'm letting him try this. You mean, you're gonna let me drink this expensive wine? I share. But oh, yeah. you're good. So you're gonna eat that, try mm. that, okay? You can go, mmm, because it is. I know, yeah? It is. It is. Mm. 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 And then you take a sip of that. 
and then you'll see what I mean. Because there's a good uh, aftertaste with it. Oh! Yeah? Oh! Yeah! Wow! I know. Man, this wine is so old. It is. It is. That's why they make it in a half bottle. So you can have you can have a glass and enjoy it with all your good yeah, wine It must stuff. be so expensive. But that's okay. It's really good. So I know the seniors ah. guys, they're at home and they're having a glass of wine. These are kind of things like salami. Yeah. Yeah, that's why they come up with this cold cuts and whatnot. But this is the best. But this also goes with this. And so. that is like, yeah, for sure it's good. You got not too much fat. In yes. It. Healthy. Oh my god, and you know they shave it really thin yeah, so yeah. easy to eat. Yeah, so I'm going to show you how we're going to do this now Okay, so we put in tomatoes red onion white onion and we have cilantro right. Okay, now I'm going to just do it. All you got to do is this. This is how easy and I'll make you another one <laughs> Okay, okay, I'll put this on the skinnier one so you can eat easier Man, I got a tough job over here. Yeah, yeah. You might have all of that you're working hard. Yeah, that's the best job. Yeah, just trying mm -hmm. Yeah Mm. Okay. Mm. See, I told mm. you. Mm. Okay. Oh wow. Well, you gotta do this two more times. Okay, now it's with the prosciutto, mm. and then you're gonna take a sip after you try that. Okay. You know, this is so hot. It is, yeah. And it's so fast. You I can't even have this for dinner. You, yes, it's been done. Mm. It's been. Mm. 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 Oh, I I mm. didn't expect that, but mm. that's okay. Okay. Mm. Now, now it's oh, with the cheese, right, okay? Right, right. Yeah. I oh, drink the oh, yeah, 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 I'm too fast, I'm too fast. <laughs> you don't like so, I drink the wine. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 you can't. I will, I will, I will, no, you're gonna, I'm not gonna drink the wine. He can drink it afterwards. Mm, no, right? you sure. Yes, yeah. yeah, that's right. I'm not gonna. Hey, you serve this at noise. Yes, we do. Oh, it must cost a lot. Yeah, that's the only thing. This is probably the only thing that costs that much money on our list. Okay, so you're gonna taste oh. that. Oh. Yeah. But do you oh. see what I mean? You know the after the aftertaste? Yeah. Yeah. Because it's ham and, yeah, and it's cured and oh. they, 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 they dry it and the whole bit and it already has the natural salts in it that they, they, they rubbed in. Mm. And when you cut it and you oh, get, oh God, you cannot, oh, it doesn't get man. any better than You know than what that. I mean, having. Yes. Oh. See, so all it is oh. is a few items. And then you know what? If you play around with it, you can see which ones you like the best. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So especially that. Now this one is with just the cheese and just the cheese. Yeah, just the cheese and the bruschetta. Yeah. So if you mm. go, to, if you go okay, I'm so happy mm. you like it. Yes! Mm. yes, 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 it's good. Can I drink wine with this? Yes, you do. That was the idea. You gotta finish that up. Thank you. Gotta you. But you, you know what? That's why you know when you go to Italian restaurants and stuff, mm. and it says um, like it's a side or an appetizer. They have bruschetta. They'll usually have this, and they just send you the bread, right? Uh. But then they'll have um, antipastos and whatnot. Mm. This will, the, the prosciutto will be separate. But I never understood that, you know. But when you drink your wine and you have all of that, mm. oh my gosh, the flavor oh, out of the wine, out of the food oh. really complements oh. each other. So you see, oh, oh, no. how good is that? It, yeah. This is like 101 yeah. wine. In yeah. That way you'll understand. So I can see, you know, like what you gotta pair stuff with, right? No. Yeah. yeah. I'm not and, good at that because I like red wine. Yeah, I love red wine too. But you know, yeah. sometimes I, I do have stuff like apple, this and that and that. Apple's and I, good. And I sit down and just pick on it and drink my wine after work and oh man, it's all good. I know. It's I agree. Good. I agree. It's That's why good. I have to share this because I go, this is, I really love this. I, all, all you I see, you guys should do this. You know, get you know, everything, get some fruits and get some of prosciutto and, mm -hmm. the you, you, and you make and you make this. This is the, this is the key. Yeah. 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 It's really good. What do you call it's this like again? Bruschetta. Bruschetta. Okay. Yeah. Bruschetta. It's like eating a salad, but then yeah. it tastes better because you have all this yeah. other and stuff that go with it. And you can put some crackers, bread, or yeah. whatever. Oh. And you see this? This is like this is like oh. five minutes. Unbelievable. Unreal. And the Parmesan, shave it. You just sprinkle it on a parchment paper, and boom. Oh. You just. I don't make that at all. Yeah. Okay. Yes, but that's what awesome. I do. Mm -hmm. So you know what? Yeah. We want to say all your wives up there. Wives Appreciation Day this month. So yes. we all appreciate you. Yes. And of course, end of the month is National Beer Day. We appreciate that too. And oh you know what, Dash? I appreciate I everything. To, Thank you so very much. I have to, I have You're to so away. awesome. Thank yeah. you. We love ah. TTA. Ah. Mm. We love Norris too. Mm. Ah. Mm. Mm. So good. Ah. Really good job. Man. 2015. Ah. So it's just right. That's awesome. Eric's five year rule. 
Okay. Yeah, okay. Wait five years. Okay. Okay. Uh, thank you. Aloha. We we'll see you around next month. Next month. Wow, it's an exciting day. I'm here at Big Ivan's Island Abalone Farm, right in Otec. Otec is an amazing place because they got the water from about 3,000 feet deep. It comes up to this beautiful pond. And yeah. here you are raising abalone. Yes. And the water is clean, it's thorough, it's everything else. So, hey, can it be better than that, right? Right. right. And I have Yoshira san here from Japan. Yes. And he's a COO and I have pasta. So, Yoshira san, tell yes. me what's going on. It's noisy. You get all the water sprinkling on the abalone. What's yeah. happening here, Yoshira san? Okay. Uh, Co op Premium Foods Hawaii is a company name. But uh, it's known as the Big Island Abalone. So, Big Island Abalone have been raising abalone for over 20 years. And our abalone is uh, Ezo Abalone. is uh, originally coming from Japan, the Miyagi Prefecture, northern part of Japan. And uh, it's known as the uh, uh, highest expensive and the precious species in Japan. So, you know, abalone is growing slowly. So even when we farm and feed them, uh, it takes uh, at least three years to sip and uh, to grow the size uh, as a sipping size. It takes three years. Yeah. yeah oh. Yeah. Sorry. And so the yeah. abalone is the best abalone that you can find in Japan. What yes. prefecture? Miyagi. Uh, Miyagi. 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 It's the best abalone there. Yeah, yes. So you bring the seeds there. You grow the abalone, it takes three years for the thing to, to come to size to eat, mm -hmm. right? Right, right. Wow! So, Masa-san, tell me a little bit more about the abalone. Hawaii is a really nice place to raise an abalone. You know, it's uh, good sunshine and we have a deep sea water which is really cold. Uh, good for abalone and raising not only abalone but also the food to abalone. So you're raising the feed over here to feed the abalone, mm -hmm. right? Right, right. Now we over here, this is where you grow the feed. Yes. Oh yeah, come on, show me what it is. This is dust. Wow. Uh, the, the feed for abalone, uh, it's coming from the west coast of California. So it's known as a sea parsley. Sea parsley. So it contains a high, a very high nutrition. Uh, so we give, we give this feed to abalone. So that's why our abalone is so uh, tasty and uh, high nutri nutrition. So you see the stuff. Yeah. This is clean. It's on the deep sea. You raise it over here. Mm -hmm. Does it taste good? Yes. Yes. Can yeah. I try? Can yeah. Try yeah. It? You can try. Oh, even even it's edible. Here you go. This is the uh, abalone that, um, this is the feed that the abalone eats. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, for oh, sweetie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can put that in poke and you know. Uh, I think so. Mm, I think miso I think. soup. Ah, yeah, 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 I think so. Uh, oh. Miso soup. Very good. Oh, very, very miso good. Soup. I brought it to Izaka na. She owners and they use it for sashimi and sushi garnish and also made a tempura with it. Okay, tell me about the, the feed. Hey. How long does it take to grow? Well, grown in two weeks. Yeah, double feet. Yeah, and so double size. And yeah. then like the abalone, how much do they eat? Uh, approximately 10% in, in a day that of their body weight. They eat 10% of their body weight? Yeah. Oh, they're hungry, eh? Yeah, yes, they are very hung, hungry. Uh, wow, it's really awesome. Okay, I, I ate the abalone before and it's so, so nice, clean, and very rich in, in the salt water flavor. It's all in the abalone. And, mm -hmm. I mean, it's to me, it's way better than abalone out in the wild. It is all, it's all pathogen free, right? Yes. Yes, that's right. Okay, tell me a little bit more, Yoshida san. Yeah, we, we use uh, very pu purified deep sea water. So we don't need any chemicals like uh, hormone, uh, antibiotics. So it's, yeah. it's all organic. 
Yeah. Oh, oh I get it. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, okay. so now abalone, you have all different sizes, right? Right, right. So from the small one, small one to the big one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you know, you know the small abalone. Mm -hmm. um, I like that. Go, you can eat it like opihi. Yeah. Sell it and eat yes. it raw like opihi. Mm -hmm. Come little bigger, mm -hmm. and you can put them on the hibachi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you can yeah, make yeah. sashimi. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, uh, masasan. Uh, you can also eat the gut more smoothly. Not on the the wild one has you know a little bit sandy, yeah. or crunchy thing. But this is a farm uh, bologna, so you can eat gut uh, more uh, less. Bitter, bitter yeah, it's less bitter, yeah. yeah. No one, no one need guy, yeah. No one need guy. <laughs> no, no one need guy. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. yeah, yeah, healthy. Yeah, really it's healthy. healthy. Yeah. yeah, because it's all seaweed in there, right? Right. Yeah. Okay, so okay. Um, you see the sun. Tell me, like, where can we find this album? KTA gonna sell it, right? Yes, KTA. Yeah. <coughs> uh, you can find KTA. Uh, yeah. 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 Almost, I think, uh, every. Yeah. Location? Yeah, and then you find. go, you go. KTA, we're gonna start selling this in um, in our stores. It's gonna be in a frozen section. Yeah. Why? You know, frozen for fresh, we freeze it right away, right? Right, right. So yeah. why do we do that? Okay, so the live abalone is uh, shell fried. Mm. It's not so long. So uh, we we install the rapid freezer. Yeah. Uh, so we can. Uh, we can take out from the plant, uh, then immediately after, uh, we we freeze it uh, within 30 minutes, so it's very fresh. Yeah, because you know, I, I've eaten the abalone fresh. I even eaten the abalone frozen because you freeze it about within 30 minutes. And the thing tastes the same. Yes, yes. Because so, it's so, so good, right? Yeah. Right. And so, that way, people can buy, leave it in the freezer when they want to take it out and, and they can make sashimi or... Yes, yeah. yes. Oh, boy. And you know what? You can use the shell too for decoration. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. In the sun, what? What are we going to do with that? Yeah, we, we want to uh, barbecue and uh, enjoy it. Okay, you're going to let me enjoy? Yeah, thank you. Okay, going oishi. Oishi! 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 How are you going to barbecue? Mm. Yeah. No, no need seasoning. No need. Just that's it. Okay. Yeah, all Just salt. like that. Okay. <laughs> Simple way to make the barbecue. Yeah. There you are. Wait. Yep. Oh. Ooh. Wait. Oh. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's, it's like extra small. Okay. It's about 10 gram uh, to 15 gram. And this is the, uh, the 20 to 35 gram and uh, uh, like a 30 to 40 gram and uh, this is for 70 to 80 gram. So you can eat this raw or you can make poke mm -hmm. and you can throw the hibachi. Hibachi, so sashimi, sushi, the steam uh, with miso or miso barbecue or like butter, uh, sakamushi, you know. Yeah, the, the more than 100 ways. More than 100 ways? Yeah. Okay. Uh, Tomasa san. Yes. You love abalone. Absolutely, I love abalone. So, how do you eat your abalone? You can eat raw and, crunch, raw and crunchy, or you can put it in uh, microwave. Oh, uh, yeah. Just a few uh, 20 seconds, 15 to 20 seconds. If the gut pops up, that's a sign to you can eat it. Yep. That's right, I put it in my microwave. Oh, there is so oily. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's um, the sign, you try. Oh. I'll see you eat. Thank you. Okay. Right. Okay. So, oh, yeah, sashimi so good. Uh, ah. Ah. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> that's the sign. Yes. You know, you eat the small abalone, mm -hmm. right? And you see the sun yeah. eat the medium abalone. Yes. And Boko, uh, Oito Boa, eat a little bigger one, okay? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. 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 <laughs> so, okay, almost done. Okay. Okay. Itadakimasu. Itadakimasu. 
already cooked, and then the peel, peel from the shell easily. Yeah. Okay. Let's eat. Mmm. So nice. Nice. Yeah. It's delicious. Wow. So you know, Big Island Abalone. They hire so many local people. We have over 20 something people that they hire here to make this place function. It is so so important for our economy. And in fact. I'm going to show you one of my friends. Hey, guess what? Hey, Big Island, Island Abalone. They hire all local, a lot of local people over here. And we got my man over here, Chris Funada. How's it? Hey, Chris here from uh, Waikia High School grad. Oh, eight. What's up? Oh, eight. So, what, you like it here? Oh, yeah, it's fun. Oh, fun. Yeah, yeah and I get, I get abalone samples all the time. Oh, boy. How's the abalone taste? Oh, pretty. Oh, he's she, bro. Oh, he's she. Oh, he's she. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you want to tell your friends out there on the Big Island? Oh, come visit Big Island Apple when you try it. Better than OP, I promise. Okay. You know what, Chris? Let's give everyone a big shaka. My man here, Chris. Awesome. Okay. You ate the Kumai abalone. <laughs> you ate the medium abalone. Yeah. And I eat the little larger abalone. Kono abalone wa. Oh, look at this. Comes right out of the shell. Clean, Chris. Wow. Oh, it's so tasty. I'm so crying. 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 I'm so I'm gonna eat the real big abalone. Oh, look at this, look at the shell. You have to wear a bag. That's why I'm so. The oyster. Mmm. Mmm. It's so juicy and so tender. And the guts and everything else. I got all the flavor inside. No. Big Island Abalone. This is the big one. Mmm! Mmm! Are you sure? All the juice in here. Ah! Oh, I see, oh! <laughs> Broke them out. Big Island Abalone. You can support them. Buy the abalone seed in the store. Hey, from Massa. Yoshida Sung and I we say Sayonara Aloha Bye 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 Oishi Every year on September 29th I think of the 442nd Infantry Regiment and the 100th Battalion soldiers who served our country involved in a battle in Italy where many lives were lost about 20 years ago, I saw this battlefield. It was a nice peaceful garden with olive trees and a beautiful monument honoring the soldiers that sacrificed their lives. As it was on September 29, 1943, when the soldiers lost their first comrade, Sergeant Shigeo Joe Takata, in a battle near Montemarano, Italy. As the veterans aged on September 29th, the sons and daughters of these AJA veterans still remembers, express their gratitude, honor, and want to pass on the legacy of these heroes. Here's a quote from Ellie Akamini of the sons and daughters of these AJA veterans. She said, We are hoping the generations that followed these proud warriors heed the call to not let their contributions be forgotten as we have benefited so much from their efforts. Yes, we need to remember the values and experiences of these war veterans and learn from it so others don't have to be faced with this similar situation. Thank you veterans for sacrificing your lives opening the doors for future generation so we 
are able to become whatever we want to be. Your sacrifices will never be forgotten, but used as an inspiration and motivation for us, the future generation. of the ruins Out from the wreckage State of the art Biomass plant Hanua'ola New generation Energy will enchant. It is now if we are ever gonna change. Replace fossil fuels till none of them remain. We replace the fossil fuel plants. Don't compare. Excited man, I got Yoshi here. I went to Big Alien Avalone and we brought some beautiful abalone. And what, what do you call this? The seaweed? Japanese say akatosaka. So you got the abalone over here, right? You see, you're picking it up. Let's see. Wow! Wow! It's so clean, that abalone, yeah? Wow! Oh! So do you have this on your menu? Is it on your menu? Uh, no, special. Oh, this special! Yeah. Oh! So what? You, oh, you oh, see, you put, uh, you put it on one skewer. Wow! 
Okay. I guess Yoshi is gonna go back there. He's gonna fry the thing in a deep fryer. <laughs> you making sashimi for yeah, sashimi and sushi. On sushi. So Yoshi, how long have you been a um, sushi chef? Uh, twenty years. Oh, oh, <laughs> twenty years already. Yeah. Wow. And you know, in sushi, what is important? The the ingredients, everything. Yeah, everything. Yeah, okay. Put it, you can see that he's putting in some taiko. You put it on the seaweed. Mm. Okay. Oh! Okay. So good, yo. Yoshi. Hi. You know, folks, if you haven't eat, eaten abalone raw, man, I tell you what, it's like the greatest tasting thing of all. <laughs> yeah? yeah. <laughs> it's so good. Oh, and you're screwing the abalone there, yeah. making it soft. And then what? That's for the sushi. Mm. Oh, yeah, look at that. So good with the knife. Wow. Oh, so you use nothing but the best rice, eh, Yoshi? Yeah. Eh? <laughs> the rice from Japan. Rice, uh, California. California. Japanese brand. Oh, Japanese brand. And then your dashi one. Hmm? Secret. Secret. Secret dashi. You see? <laughs> eh? Secret dashi. Okay, look at that. Oh, man. Wow. So good, Yoshi. Oh, what's that? This is Kosakashi. Oh, that's the one I got from. Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, this is the seaweed, yeah. right? This is the um, abalone katsu. This is the sashimi abalone. Look at that. Huh? And then the sushi abalone on this nice uh, seaweed. It's all from the Oceanic Institute because, you know, Yoshi, he used nothing but the best, nothing but the freshest. And he tried to use as much local products as, as possible. I'm going to try to taste it and see how good it is. Um, How's that, Yoshi? Uh, good, 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 good. I, I'm with the princess over here, Yuka. Yuka is uh, really, she works for she owners. She's just the most pleasant person that you can ever think of. <laughs> Yuka, you know, your sushi chef is so good, Thank right? You. He makes yeah. all this great stuff. And you know, he uses a lot of fresh products. He has a lot of local stuff, mm -hmm. right? Yes, he's from Japan. He's from Japan, that's yeah. why. So, Yuka, mm -hmm. tell me about your new uh, location here. Uh, we are uh, Izakaya Shiono. We just opened uh, June 15th. It's another location for Shiono Group. And it's a Japanese Izakaya. It's like a Japanese pop style. And uh, we have sushi, uh, kushikatsu, and ramen, and we make a uh, fresh noodle here. In oh, you, you make the noodles yourself yes. here? Yes, we make noodles. Wow, yeah, I cannot wait. <laughs> Man, no wonder, you know, I saw so many people here just ordering the ramen. And you know, in, in, in Japan, I know they eat ramen, hot day, cold days, and everything oh, yeah. else. Any time is good time for ramen. Uh, yeah, anytime's good. And I know that you folks have all different types of ramen. Mm -hmm. Yo, shoyu, miso, tonkotsu, and tonkotsu shoyu. Okay. Mm -hmm. So what should I eat from me? Look, he, he made some beautiful sashimi. Yeah, Look at that arrangement. Uh, and he made sushi, mm -hmm. right? Uh, wow. Good. And then here, he made tempura. Mm -hmm. Look at it. He just made it beautiful. Seaweed tempura. Yeah, we, we found that, found that seaweed from uh, Otan. Yes. And then he made some uh, abalone katsu. Mm -hmm. Wow. And here, the ramen. Ramen, yeah? yes. Man, you see what? What kind of ramen? Tonkotsu. Tonkotsu. Okay, so, sashimi. Okay. So I put some uh, wasabi in here. Okay, we start with the sashimi. Abalone sashimi. Look at this. Perfect. Oh! 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 It's crunchy. It's fresh. Oh! I just love it. Mmm! Mmm! 
Mom, this is so good. Yeah, you should eat with some uh, seaweed too. Mom, you do with some seaweed? Yeah. You know, it's the first time I saw this seaweed down at the uh, yeah, ocean. Yeah. yeah. And I never thought it was edible, right? I know they feed this with abalone, too, yeah? Yeah, a lot of nutrition, actually. Yeah, a lot of nutrition. Okay, try this. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm all excited. Eh? Mm. 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 It's so good. Wow. Yeah. Let me let me try the sushi. You know, your Yoshi is one of the best sushi maker in the whole world. I, the other day I came over here, he even made one up uh, with a menpachi, he made a nice sashimi oh, platter. Yeah. Uh -huh. I was so impressed. He can, he can do anything that man. Anything, yeah. Oh man. He has a very good experience. Yeah. yeah. Oh here you go, abalone sushi. Mmm! 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 Oh, it's so oishy! Before I get full, mm -hmm. I try tempura now. Because some salt on top here. Okay. Oh! Oh! Good? It's from that chiwi. Yeah, it's so oishy! No, I just had it. It's really good. Oh! And it's healthy, uh -huh. yeah. Mmm. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Like mm. <laughs> oh, I really like it. Nice, right? I know that a lot of people order tempura over here mm -hmm. too, yeah. You guys have make good tempura, mm -hmm. tempura, yeah. tonkatsu, yeah. Mm -hmm. Tonkatsu. Mm -hmm. Oh, Japanese style. Yes. Uh -huh. Yoshi was trying in uh, Tsukiji. Mmm. Is that right? Yeah. Yoshi. Years, yes. Wow. This is a abalone. Oh, yeah, cut it. Oh, make it jealous. <laughs> oh. 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 Oh, wow. Oh, man. Mmm. 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 I totally like it. Oh. And what do we have here? Ramen. Ramen. Yes. So, yuca. You know, you know, and sure knows, you guys are really good because you guys employ a lot of workers, mm -hmm. right? You have a lot of workers working here, help the economy, you know, and I, I, I really thank you folks, you know. Oh, thank and, you. And, and I see you. Yeah, <laughs> and, I, and I see your, um, all your workers, they're all happy. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, they've been working so long. I know, and like I talked to one, he said, oh, he's been here 10 years, yeah, and you know. Yeah. Yeah? And um, you know you can you can see that it's really good, but they don't leave, huh? Eh? Mm. Like working. Must be you, eh? Oh, must eh? be me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, ramen. Yes. Mmm. Oh. Mm. Oh, this noodles is so good. Yeah. So freshly made here. Yes. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. And this is? Tikurage. Tikurage. Kind of mushroom. Oh! Mm. Oh! Oh! Hey, this is like better than Japan. <laughs> hey, anybody want ramen? They come here. This is better than Japan ramen. Mmm! Yeah. Mmm! And the chak Yeah? Sure, yes. Mmm! And big piece of him! Mmm! Mmm! Mm. Mm. Okay, Yuka, what's your hours and what day you open? Oh, the hours are uh, Monday through Friday. Mm. Uh, lunchtime is 11 to 2 o'clock. 
Mm. And dinner time Monday through Saturday, uh, five to nine o'clock. Oh. So Sunday closed. Oh, you closed Sunday. We closed Sunday because we had to make noodle. The Sunday we make noodle. <laughs> so Sunday you actually work, but you make noodle. Yes. Oh. We make noodles. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> but I want to thank you, uh, Yuka. Yeah, thank you very much for coming. This is so amazing. The Arigato food is good. Gozaimasu. Yoshi is the best sushi chef. I see, yeah, yeah, he can he can do all kind of sashimi okay. with all kinds of fish. Mm -hmm. uh, very, very talented. Yeah. I see your uh, uh, ramen in there, you know, you gotta do it the real Japan style, yes. right? You have the ramen machine too, I see oh, yeah. there in there. Mm -hmm. All Japanese style, you guys do stuff, yeah. you know, and, and this is really an authentic Japanese yeah. restaurant. So, Thank you, you, so you know what? The service here is unreal. Mm -hmm. We got people like Yuka here. So nice and friendly, yeah. So you know, I want everyone to come on down to um, Izakaya Shionos and all the Shionos location because you know, yeah. The, yeah, in Mauna Laria, I went there. The food, in fact, I go there a lot. The food is so good. It's yeah. real, yeah. the real Japanese food, mm -hmm. yeah. And it's so tasty. The atmosphere is so great. So yeah. come on down. All the Shionos location. The food is. <laughs> Oh, it's all oishi. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, aloha, bye bye. Welcome. We are here at the new Shono Izakaya restaurant. Please come on down. We have ramen, kushikatsu, sushi, everything. Come on down. Come on down. Today, as I think about conflict, I wonder why we are not able respect the differences of others. Thinking about my experiences, three times over the past seven years, I visited the World Trade Center site. And every visit, observing workers working hard 24 hours every day. With every visit, I feel a sense of sorrow and depression, thinking about the innocent people that lost their lives and the fortunate ones that escaped the tragedy with memories that perhaps changed their lives. Yes, this tragedy affected everyone's lives, financially and socially. As you hear the water falling into two giant pools, this is where the Twin Towers stood. The North Pool and South Pool represents the Twin Tower with names of those innocent victims of this tragedy. Around the North and South Pools are a peaceful park. Walking in the park, you can sense and feel the sorrow and sadness of everyone due to the still, peaceful, quiet atmosphere. Now, 13 years later, the Memorial Museum has opened. So now we're able to memorialize those that lost their lives and ensure the tragedy is something we should never forget. For me, there's no words to express such a tragedy except the need for peace in this world, to understand the value of one's life, to prevent hurting or abusing others, not only physically, but mentally. We need to bring peace and happiness to all. Lucky we live Hawaii, a place where we live as one family, being responsible for others as well as being responsible for ourselves. That video was done in 2014 to remember that day, September 11, 2001. Now, 19 years later, we are faced with another crisis, the COVID-19 pandemic causing economic hardship not only for our National Financial District of Manhattan, but for the entire world. To get out of this crisis, it would take every person to be responsible to stop the spread of the virus. Wear masks and practice six feet social distances. Constantly wash your hands the proper way with soap and water. Stay home. If you're sick, do not spread the virus. Remember, we all need to work together. Take the responsibility to stop the spread of COVID-19. 
Thank you and aloha. Wow, Hawaii Island is facing a tough year. I beg all of you to be responsible and let's work together to stop the spread of COVID-19 on our island. We all need to move on to help bring back our local economy. We need to support new businesses and industry that creates jobs on our island. The pandemic affected lots of businesses and industries financially, creating hardship not only for the business owners, but for all of its employees. This creates a ripple effect on all businesses and even our government and this beautiful island. So I ask you, please support the many Hawaii Island businesses in whatever way possible. Business affiliated with tourism, restaurants, flower and plant in industry, retail shops, shopping centers, jewelry stores, hair salon, and so on. We need to support them. Support them and get their business back to the way it was or make it even better. With that, I say, support local, buy local, it matters. Aloha. Welcome to Behind the Camera. September is Labor Day, a time we thank and salute and honor all the working and retired laborers. Laborers are the backbone of our country. Our world would not be what it is without you. Seniors, due to the COVID pandemic, this is a tough time where our normal way of life has changed. But please, we need to keep active and stay alert. But please, please, please be safe. Please always wear a clean mask. Stay six feet away from others. Constantly wash or sanitize your hands. But more so, call a doctor or friend and stay at home if you're not feeling well. I cannot take any selfies. I've modified photos from September 2017 to September 2019. Thank all of our seniors for making a difference so we are able to live a better life. We appreciate the hard work and sacrifices you made. Thank you, seniors for being so special. Hey, Karen, guess who I see? Your daughter. What do you want to tell your, your mom? Hi! Okay, give the shaka. Shaka to your mom. Hey, guess what, man? Hey, my friends from Kekula, Navahi, Okalani, Opu, man. Navahi, that guy on Plama. Who you, who you work for now? Qualified Plami. Yeah, hey, yeah, hey, hey, brother. Hey, what? Good work, huh? Yeah. Yeah, you're the Damn boss, hey. Qualified Plami. Awesome. Give the shaka, give the shaka. Jeez. My friend Mendoza from um, Takalao. Hey, so uh, what do you guys do? Oh, we do flooring. Oh, you guys do flooring. Eh? So you didn't need to do flooring. Who do you call? You call Paul's in the practice. Okay, and you ask for the guys right there, man. Hey, yeah. Yeah, give the shaka, shaka, shaka. Paul in the practice. Mahalo. Hello. Guess what, man? My friend, he went by Penny Poor yesterday at KTA. What you bought today? Wait. Yeah. Fish, fish to go along with the KTA. Oh. Okay. Aku and Upin. Okay, you don't dry them. <laughs> you know that. Okay, give all your friends a shaka. And I get my friend here, man. Hey, let tell your friends out there. Uh, on my boy and yeah. long board. Okay. All right. Give the shaka, give the shaka. Yeah. <laughs> I got my friend from Kau. Give the shaka, give the shaka. Yeah. <laughs> so what family is this? This is the Ponce family. The nah, Ponce family, give everybody the shaka. All right, shaka. Hey, so Ricky, you painter, eh? Painter. Eh? So wait, what? Carpenter, painter. Okay, what company? Uh, Fujitake. Fujitake, you the man. Okay, give the shaka. Hey, guess what I see in Honolulu, man? Hey, the Maligas boy. Eh? Oh, right on. Hey, 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 you so, know hey. name. Hey, so what? What do you want to tell your brother? I go tell my brother, Cal, I met the guy I was watching on TV. I don't, I don't know your name, but I was telling my brother. Hey, this guy, he's a man. Okay, right big on. shaka, big shaka. Right on, Cal. Oh, yeah. The man right here. Okay, easy. Hey, guess what, man? I get my special friends there. What do you want to tell anyone out there? Hi, Evan Hart and Mom. Okay, give Evan Hart and Mom a big shaka. 
Hey, John, you got ULV, UNLV, right? Yeah. Hey, you know your grandpa, he's an awesome, great grandpa, he's an awesome guy. What do you think? John Kim. Hey, guys, give the shaka. Oh, yeah, bet. I'm going down okay. happy. I'm okay. grandpa happy going UNLV. Okay, awesome. We meet Ranger Rick here at the Volcanoes um, Observatory Center. So, hey, what do you want to tell everyone in Hilo? Living in paradise. And our boy Ranger Rick, awesome. Aloha, aloha. Come see us. Come see us. You get Bruce over here. Right, so Bruce, what do you want to tell George? You was our number one teacher in school, and I was there, and I never forget you. Give George the shaka. <laughs> That was the amazing September of 2017 and we head on now to September of 2018. He was a patient man I learned a lot from my grandpa He was a working man He was so proud the day he bought His first automobile Although not new, it would do it was his pride and joy. Grandfather's chakalaka, chakalaka car. Grandfather's chakalaka, chakalaka car. If you have a computer, go to KTA Superstars and watch all of the Seniors Living in Paradise program. Yeah, my friend Eric, hey, look at Eric, man. Hey, how's it, everybody? Hey, you know Eric, he's the most awesome guy. What do you like to tell everybody out there? I like to tell him hello, how are you all? Okay, give the big shaka, Eric. Yeah, the big shaka. Yeah, so then I get my friend here buying eggs at KTA. What do you use the eggs for? This one I will crack with, brother. Okay, give the big shaka. Hey, yeah. Brother. Here's our Reverend Miyazaki. He's like the greatest sensei of all. So, um, <laughs> you know, he does um, genealogy things, right? Yeah. So, he did a Japanese American wants to find out the family, but they call you. Yeah, yeah, please. <laughs> okay, okay, Reverend Miyazaki. Mentoring. Mentoring. Okay, good man. Thank you. Arigato. Guess what, man? We get the golfers over here. These guys are shooting so awesome. Big news. Big news. Okay. Big shaka! Big shaka! Fake news! Hey, Auntie Lorraine, Hi, Auntie Alicia Lorraine. over here, man. Hey, Hi. what do you tell Auntie? Hi, Auntie Lorraine, love you! Okay, and she loves the uh, pork and terry sandwiches. Get the pork and terry right? sandwiches. Oh, every Delicious. Monday. Every, every Monday, Monday, Auntie. Okay, we'll see the... you soon. Okay, big shaka, big shaka. Big shaka, aloha! Hey, what's that? my man, big shaka, big shaka. Okay, here we go. Okay. Oh, yeah. Hey brother, I love you man, aloha. <laughs> we get the greatest family around here. Eh? What family? Kealoha. The Kealoha family. Why don't we give everybody one shot? Shaka. Yes sir, I get my friend Brittany here. What are you going to tell everybody out there? Aloha. Big, 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 another big shot. Awesome. Hey, I get the man of it, a good golfer, smart guy. He's the most, I think he's the brainiest guy in the whole island here. Hey, so what do you like to tell everyone out there? Shop at KTA, okay? You see how smart he is? Okay, yes. big shaka, big shaka. Shaka, <laughs> mahalo. Spend the low for Kalapana. Hey, Spend what do you like to tell everyone out there? Come shop KTA, it's the best store. Oh, you awesome, man. Trendle, give the big shaka. Yeah, you see, here's the man, Trendle from Kalapana. Man, I got my friends here at KTA. What are you gonna tell all your friends out there? I'm gonna tell everybody to be nice and be loving to one another. Just oh, like my buddy yeah. friend here. Okay, yeah. give the big shaka, give the big shaka. Yeah, okay. Stacy, you wanna yes. tell hi to anybody out there, your, your family in corner? Hi, Mom. <laughs> you see, hey, awesome girl, great values. Thanks for bringing her up. I tell you what, man, it's a real Kona style. Kona style. Very good. Awesome. Big shaka, big shaka. Hey, guess what, man? I got people from Kato Radio. What do you want to tell everyone out there? Hey, aloha, everybody out there in the Big Island. Watch, guys. Listen to Kato Radio. Listen to AM1210. We can hear loud and clear over there. That's picture, baby. Thank you. Awesome. Okay. Hey, look, hey, grandma oh. and granddaughter, hey, give the big shaka, give the big shaka, shaka! <laughs> that was the fantastic 2018, and we hit on now to September of 2019. So friends and family all pitched in for the reward of stew. But grandfather always made the time for 
glorious pride and joy. Elbow grease and Simon eyes, he never compromised. Grandfather's chakalaka, chakalaka car. Grandfather's chakalaka, chakalaka car. Whenever I see a working man with not too fancy a car, I'll always think of my grandpa. Anyone in the world can watch Seniors Living in Paradise by logging on to kdasuperstores.com. There is my CTAR um, extension agent, and they're in charge of food safety. Come on, give them one tip out there. Come on. Hey guys, make sure you inspect your produce well and wash, rinse, wash, rinse, and look twice so that you stay healthy and active. Yeah, wash, rinse, wash, rinse. Right, Maui, Maui agent, what? That's right, it's everybody's responsibility. Okay, give the big shaka. Yes, ah. Hey, guess what, man? I got the most talented guy in the world. This is Tony from All Kind Repairs. We do everything from plumbing to electrical to everything you need done. Yeah, uh, my phone number 938-5119. One call does it all. He's like so talented, he can do anything. <laughs> hey, give the big shaka. Come on, Tony. That's Tawaha. <laughs> Simply said the wedding store. And they got tuxedos, they got everything to rent, to buy, wedding gowns and everything else in the Prince Cohill Plaza. Big shaka again. He's brought it here. He go to Honolulu to watch football. Yeah, yeah. And then the thing is on Saturday, but he goes Friday. What are you gonna do tonight? Drink. Ah, <laughs> drink. Okay, give Shaka to the drink. Hey, guess what, man? Here, my friend, the best Filipino cook, right? <laughs> what are you gonna cook? You gonna make chicken sabaw? Chicken sabaw with a uh, fresh mushroom. Okay, awesome. Hey, you know what? The thing is naimas, eh? Naimas. Okay. Naimas. KTA, naimas. The best. Uh, give, give the big shaka, big big shaka. Hey, guess what, man, Jack? Who I see over here? Come on, come on, tell Victoria, Jack something. Victoria, your wife. Okay. Look, your favorite guy. <laughs> okay. Give Jack the big shaka. Yes, uh, from Hawaii. Awesome. <laughs> Look at the pretty girl there, yeah, from Hawaii <laughs> and the mom. Yeah? Yes. Uh, come on, awesome mom here. Yeah. Yeah? Yes, I do. Okay, buddy, guys, big shaka. Yeah. Yeah. Give the brother, brother. Go here, tell everyone out there. Come on, come on. Aloha. Okay, give the big shaka. Yeah. Yeah, I get the best looking customer here. Yeah. Actually, when he come in, it's like Hollywood. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, what KTA, this guy. Give him a shaka. Give him a shaka. Give him a shaka. Guess what, man? The funniest man in town. We get all these. We need glasses. We need glasses. What do you, what do you like telling about on the big island? Like, oh. Keep watching their show. Go to KTA. Get oh. all your products from KTA. Oh, awesome. And whenever I'm there, please, somebody take me out to go eat. Okay. Hey. This guy can grind. I'm okay, give a big shaka to everybody. Okay, guess what? I got this beautiful lady in the wall. Why do you want to tell someone on the big island? I want to say hello to Hawaii guys. I have a nice friend named Laverne and Eugene Fukushima. Okay, big shaka to them. Shaka! Okay, here's the most awesome family. Come on, give the big shaka. Come on, shaka, shaka. Yeah, my friend Clarence. Hey, Clarence, you can say something in your native language. My native language, uh, when I go to the store back home, uh, I think it's thank you, Miss Lomala. Okay. Thank you. Okay, very good. Aloha. Aloha. Wait, 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 wait. Big shaka, big shaka, big shaka. Hey, who's this pretty girl there? Oh, man, my niece. That's your niece. Wow, pretty lady. Hey, so, where did we catch you on TV? K2 N, Sunday, 6.30. Be there or be square. Okay. But remember, now truth in the kitchen, you can do the cooking. Okay, big shaka. So please remember to be safe, always wear a mask, practice social distancing, 
of six feet. But more so, constantly wash your hands. And if you're not feeling well, call a doctor or friend and please stay home. So that's it for Behind the Camera. But before we go, I want to thank our volunteer cameramen, George and Shirley Ito. And thank you so much for watching us on Seniors Living in Paradise. We'll see you tomorrow night. Aloha.